In an Antiques Roadshow episode, two sisters explained how their family had lived in Trinidad for generations and they arrived for the BBC valuation with some special paintings. Their great-grandfather had created some wildlife-inspired paintings, and the sisters had also brought along some works by Trinidad's first painter, Maisel Jean Casabon. These are terrific, our expert trooper declared as he observed the paintings. How many generations has your family lived in Trinidad? He asked the two guests. About five. One replied as Rupert pointed to one of the paintings and continued, So your great-grandfather is this artist here. And this is a typical Trinidadian view, I suppose isn't it, of that age. But this is a sort of Edenic view, you know, like the Garden of Eden, of a Caribbean island really. It's the mid-19th century, and he was taught by this artist and the artist of these two paintings whose name was Maisel Jean Casabon. Well Casabon, of course, is terribly important in many ways because he was Trinidad's first painter and he had a school there and many people were taught by him. Don't miss! Take a look inside the life of bargain hunts David Harper, latest. Corey's Daniel Brocklebank absolutely devastated over co-star's exit, latest, GB News Eamon Holmes launches fresh attack on Meghan Markle, latest, Rupert probed, which do you prefer, Kazabon's or your great-grandfather's? I prefer my great-grandfather's, I've always loved it as a whole, one of the sisters replied. What do you think they're worth? Rupert later asked, referring to the series of paintings displayed. Haven't got a clue, the owner admitted before Rupert explained his expertise. He commented, well, starting with your great-grandfather's, pictures of the Caribbean this early are really quite sought after. £1,000 to £1,500 I would have thought would just about cover it, and then it should do better at auction. The guests were thrilled to hear their family members' work was worth so much. Speaking of Kazabon's work, he said, and then these two well, as I say, I think this one is slightly faded. So I'm going to go down a bit to £10,000 to £15,000. My parents would be shocked at that, one of the guests revealed. Rupert continued, this one which I'm afraid I prefer even if you don't, I've got that at £15,000 to £20,000. Goodness me, one of the women remarked before the other added, unbelievable. The two appeared lost for words as they took in the unexpected news. Thank you, that's, yeah, that's lovely, one added. However, the two explained they wouldn't sell the items. We've had them so long, we can't part with them, she declared. They're part of Trinidad and part of you, Rupert stated. Antiques Roadshow continues on Sunday at 7pm on BBC One.